Hey there folks, in today's video I'm going to show you how to clean the coils on a Black & Decker portable air conditioner. Now first thing you're going to want to do is take off this filter here. And we'll vacuum that off, clean it up before we reinstall it. For now I'll just set it aside. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to start taking all the screws off. So there's screws all the way down both sides. One in the middle here, here, and here. And just make note, there are four screws that are longer than the others. And those ones are just above the handle here on both sides and at the very bottom. As for the rest of them, they're all short screws and equal length. Alright, so once you have all the screws out, this whole back outer shell will come off. So you just tilt the bottom out, top will come out. And it'll just lift off like that. Now the fun thing about this one, there's a sideways coil and I'll show you a special bit on the vacuum that we can use to make it easier to clean. And then there's this one here. Now the bit that I'm using here is a long thin wand made by ShopVac. It's a detailing wand. I'll put a link in the description below for that. It makes it nice and handy to get into that little area there. We're going to start with the first one. We won't use the wand for that because it's easy to get to. We'll just use the wand for the bottom one. All right, so we got a little bit of extra light in there for you so you can see what's going on. So now this is where the wand comes in handy. It'll get in there nicely. Alright folks, so now that we have that all vacuumed out, our next order of business is to put the shell back on. So we're just going to put the top on first. Slide it into place and screw it back together. All right, so we're just going to vacuum off that filter real quick. So that's the filter right there. It just separates nice and easy. Mm. 
And then we place it all back together. Put your filter on. And that's all there is to it, folks. Hopefully you found this helpful. And you'll give this a shot, a little DIY. And as, as always, please like and subscribe.